Welcome to this tutorial on the Motive Driver app. Motive is an electronic logging device, also known as an ELD, used to track a driver's hours of service, commonly referred to as HOS. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to use the Motive Driver app effectively to record your hours of service and manage your driving logs with ease. We'll cover the following topics in this tutorial. Hours of Service Overview Introduction to the Motive Driver app How to make a daily log entry using the Motive Driver app How to edit your log or insert a past duty status And How to use inspection mode during roadside checks Let's start with an overview of Hours of Service, or HOS. Why is HOS important? HOS regulations are designed to improve road safety by helping manage driver fatigue, one of the leading causes of commercial vehicle accidents. How is it managed? Drivers are required to track their work and rest periods using daily logs, which help ensure they're staying within legal driving limits and getting enough rest between shifts. Who does it apply to? These regulations apply to all commercial drivers. Maintaining accurate logs is not just best practice, it's a mandatory requirement for their role. Understanding and following HOS rules is essential for compliance, safety, and professional responsibility. The Motive Driver app makes recording your hours of service, or HOS, fast and easy, right from your phone. To get started, download the Driver app on your iOS or Android device by scanning the QR codes displayed on the screen. Once installed, you'll be ready to log in and manage your driving hours with just a few taps. To begin, log into your Motive Driver app by entering your username and password. If you're a new employee, check your inbox for an email with your login credentials provided by your company. Now, when you are logged into the Motive Driver app, you're ready to begin your daily log entry. In this section, you will first learn how to change your duty status from off duty to on duty. Next, you will learn how to select your vehicle in the app and perform a pre-trip inspection. You will also be introduced to the connection indicators on the vehicle gateway that is attached to your vehicle. Finally, this section will conclude with a quick walkthrough on how to change your duty status back to off-duty. Go to the Motive Driver app on your phone and click on the Logs button. Now click where it says Off-Duty. In the window that opens, select On. Make sure that location tracking on your phone is enabled. To verify, tap the circular location marker button. If location services are disabled, please enable them when your phone prompts you. Finally, add any necessary notes and tap Save. Now when you are on duty, click where it says No Vehicle to begin selecting a unit for driving. Select the unit that you will be driving. For this tutorial, we will be using Unit 1040 as an example. Upon selecting the unit, the app will prompt you to review the last three inspections and sign off. During your pre-trip, check for any defects mentioned in these inspections and assess whether the unit is still drivable. Upon prompted, click Continue to begin your inspection. In the window that opens up, do not change the mileage if it is already populated. If there is no mileage given, click Edit and input the data from the vehicle's dashboard. Finally, input the license plate of the vehicle if it is not already populated. You can now begin your inspection. Click the thumbs up button for no defects. Click Hazard button when you find a defect. Finally, under Defect Type, click Change to select minor, major or not sure depending on the type of defect. If you are unsure of the defect type, always select Not Sure and Inform Dispatch. Within the Defect window, add notes to highlight the defect you observed. Take a picture by clicking the camera button. Finally, click Save and continue with your inspection. Once you have identified all the defects, save your inspection by signing it. Your device will now attempt to connect to the gateway on the unit. If you encounter any issues, check that your phone's Bluetooth is enabled and the low power mode is switched off. Note that connecting with the gateway may take several minutes. Once connected, your unit number will appear here on the app. To verify if your phone is connected to the vehicle gateway, there are two indicators to check. 
First, the two LED lights on the vehicle gateway will turn green. Second, the ELD icon on the Motive Driver app will also turn green. You have successfully logged into Motive and are now ready to begin driving. Your driving status is automatically tracked by the app. Hence, no manual tracking required by the person driving. To change the duty status from on duty to off duty and begin your rest period, go to the Motive Driver app. Go to Logs. Click the unit number you are driving and press Leave Vehicle. The app will prompt you to conduct a post trip inspection. Click Continue. In the new window that opens up, follow the same procedure of vehicle inspection as pre trip. Again, do not change the mileage if it is already populated. If there is no mileage given, input the data from the vehicle's dashboard. After completion of the post trip inspection, click Certify and Save. Now when you have exited the vehicle, click where it says On Duty. Select Off. Add location if not shown already. Then add notes and click Save. You are now off duty with no vehicle attached to your phone. We are now going to explore how to edit daily logs and insert a past duty status. Remember, daily logs can only be edited or have past duty statuses added if the logs are unsigned. Therefore, to request any changes to signed logs, please contact Dispatch. To begin editing a daily log on the Motive app, go to Logs. Select the unsigned log that you wish to edit. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will select the daily log from Wednesday, February 5th. Click the log entry that you want to edit. Click the Edit button that appears next to it. Edit the timings in the space given or use the gray markers. Select the duty status for the timings entered above. In this example, the status is changed from off duty to on duty. Add a note explaining the change. Finally, click Save. Notice the change in timing after editing the log entries. To certify the log, click Sign from the navigation bar at the top. Click Sign Log and then add your signature. Click Agree to certify the log. Note that daily logs cannot be edited once you have certified them. When prompted on the screen, click Yes if your log is correct and no edits are required. Let's look at how to insert a past duty status. Go to Logs and click on the date where you want to insert the duty status. For the purpose of this training, we will use Sunday, February 2nd. In the new window that opens, First, verify that the date at the top is correct. Then, click the plus sign at the bottom right corner. Click the option that says Insert Past Duty Status. In the window that opens, enter the start and end times for the duty status. Next, select the appropriate duty status from the list. Add the location where the duty status occurred. Finally, include a brief note explaining the change. Once all fields are completed, you're ready to save the entry. Your past duty status is now added to the log, as shown in the picture. Once the changes accurately reflect your schedule for the day, follow the procedure to sign the log. Remember, review regularly. Stay familiar with the Motive app, its features, and updates. Stay compliant. Always follow hours of service, HOS, regulations to ensure safety. Accuracy matters. Keep your logs accurate and up-to-date to avoid violations. Reach out for support. If you face any issues with the Motive app, don't hesitate to contact your supervisor or support team. Let us now take a look at the last and most important feature in this tutorial, Inspection Mode. Inspection mode is designed to facilitate roadside inspections and ensure compliance with hours of service HOS, regulations. It allows drivers to easily present their logs and other required information to enforcement officers without compromising their personal data or account privacy. You can find the inspection mode by clicking on the three bars given at the top left corner. When the enforcement officer asks for inspection, click Begin Inspection and hand over your phone. 
Begin inspection button will display the driver's logs for the past 14 days. You can navigate the logs using the arrows at the top. The officer may ask for an ELD output. ELD is the motive box attached to your unit. To email the details, click the Send Output File button. In the new window, select the unit you are driving. Add the email address that the officer provides. Add the official comment and then press Send. Furthermore, the officer may also ask you to email your daily logs. On the inspection window, click Send Logs. Now add the email address that the officer provides. Add official comment and click Send. Thank you for completing the Motive app training. We hope this tutorial helps you use the app with confidence. Remember, safe driving starts with you. Stay alert, stay compliant, stay safe.